Welcome back to the Tactical Family Channel. We have another episode in our ammo stockpiling series. Today we have some ammo from American Eagle, some 40 s and for our Springfield XD40. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at this ammunition. Alright, again, so you guys can see we have some American Eagle 40 s and This is a 180 grain full metal jacket. And on the back of the box, which is a nicely printed, we have the velocity. So we have a muzzle velocity of 1,000 FPS. And we have a muzzle energy of 400 foot-pounds. So for this ammunition here, we did buy a case. Uh, we have 20 boxes of 50 rounds for a total of 1,000 rounds of 40. And here's the bullet right here. You guys can see the round. You can There's your 180 grain uh, bullet followed by the nice brass color casing. Now we're not going to go ahead and take this one apart because we've taken several of the 40 apart already. And again, this is just uh, what I would consider my range ammo. It will be going into my range stockpile. Um, doesn't mean you can't use it for uh, self-defense or in an SHTF situation. It just means this is the uh, less expensive ammunition that I purchased specifically to train with. And we've already taken uh, several of these uh, apart. Alrighty, this video might be a little bit shorter than the other ones, but again, I have a little, kind of a, quite a bit of ammunition still to get through. Um, but just want to show some additional ammo that I did purchase. This has been purchased before July 1st. I have not gone out yet to uh, attempt to purchase yet. Um, I do need to go do that, and I actually plan to do that um, very soon here. So anyways, 1,000 rounds adding a 40 S&W, 140, 180 grain full metal jacket ammo to our ammo stockpile for our uh, range slash training ammunition. Now even though we do have that new law where you do have to go through a background process to purchase ammunition, uh, we shouldn't let that necessarily um, prevent us from going out and purchasing ammunition. Uh, you should at least go out and uh, get some here and there. Again, um, I'm a bit wary myself personally about purchasing very large quantities of ammunition, especially large quantities at a time like I would do before when I'd uh, order or go purchase, you know, a thousand to three, three, two or three thousand rounds at a time. Um, I'm a bit wary on doing that, um, but, you know, you should still go and continuing to uh, get ammunition because you never ever know when something else is going to change and I've already heard that California has talked about limiting the amount of ammunition that you can own and limiting the amount of ammunition that you can purchase in a time period. So again those things especially here in California are a very real reality that can happen. So get your ammunition now while you can uh, because you never know when something like that might come up and you don't want to be caught in struggling try to buy ammunition uh, before a new law like that may take effect and you know everybody else is out buying and you might just be SOL. American Eagle ammo in my eyes is a pretty good ammunition it's obviously by Federal Ammunition it's a one of their lines um, I've used it the majority of all the ammunition I've ever used has all been for uh, range and training and uh, everything that I recall good ammunition. Um, I personally don't even recall um, a round not going off. Um, everything seems to be made quality from them which is what I would expect especially coming from uh, Federal Ammunition. So it's something I can highly recommend. Uh, it's not super expensive ammunition. American Eagle is a little bit more than um, different types of ammunition but typically you know you can find this ammunition at um, sports stores and stuff like that that uh, have sales running on. Um, even gun stores, um, different gun stores I go to, you know, sometimes they're running sales or just in general, again, not that expensive. Or you can still order online, have it shipped to an FFL and go through the background process, check um, through that and that person that uh, you have the ammunition shipped to. But other than that, good ammo. Thank you everybody for stopping by and checking out this video. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. And if you guys have any comments or questions, please feel free to leave them. And you guys have a wonderful day.